Hey y'all, welcome back to another Daily Scuttlebutt with Ivy's Family Fact Totem. So, yeah, I, I'm going ahead and recording one for the weekend. Today is Saturday. I don't normally do this on the weekend, but our internet just, uh, yeah, it sucks. <laughs> I really no, no other way to say that. So, I'm currently driving in the town. I need to go get some some items that way I can finish with the Jeep getting it put back together uh, I don't have a torque wrench big enough so uh, I have to head to town obviously I, I want to make sure that the bolts are torqued not just tight you know to the, the correct specifications because it, it's a family vehicle you know, it's got my wife and kids in there so I don't I don't want to be putting it back together and have it fall apart right uh, with that, right, I've actually had a friend reach out to a friend to see if I could borrow one. Nothing. Didn't help out. Uh, I've even uh, texted out, you know, folks in the community to see if I might be able to borrow one. I uh, didn't get any re response. And I, I can't just sit around all morning waiting. So it's, sometimes, you know, you can get help from the community. Sometimes you can't. So... Sometimes you just gotta go out and, and do it, right? Not that I ever, you know, reach out for handouts or or anything like that. I don't I don't like reaching out for handouts, but when I'm in a, a time of need and not wanting to go spend a whole lot of money, you know, I'm gonna reach out to the community. But sometimes the community is busy, or sometimes the, the community's doing something else that they're not gonna be able to help. So now I gotta go spend money. I don't got. That's all right because it's something that you know. It's not going to be just like a one and done thing. Tools are tools. They're they're going to be around. You're going to be able to use them on other projects. So it's fine. I've I've needed to get you know. It's it's a foot pound torque wrench. I've needed to have one. I've had an inch pound torque wrench for many years, but I've never had a foot pound. So now I'm going to go get one. But I do apologize once again just for our, our cruddy internet. I know it's it, it really is what it is, but I I started the, the video that came out it I don't know what time it came out, but it came out sometime after midnight Saturday morning because the the published date is today's date, eighteen. But I started that upload at 8 o'clock in the morning on Friday. 8 o'clock in the morning. But it's like 8, 10, 8, around there, right? I'll just say 8 o'clock. So, yeah. You know, with storms coming through or just whatever it is, because we're, we're basically in a dead zone whenever it comes to cell service, so it's, it's like hit or miss. Plus, you know, anyone that's had a cell phone long enough knows that you know they they throttle the the bandwidth right it's going to go up and down whatever your plan is right we have unlimited data but you only get so much data at 4g 5g before it gets throttled down to 3g and then it's really slow right so when you're doing video uploads and, and such you know you're, you're going to go through that data fairly quick now with the because uh, we have the the Wi-Fi, you know, but that that's more for the, the family because we use that for the TV. We use that for you know everybody else that needs to be on Wi-Fi type stuff. But normally the computers or anything or like my phone, right? I'll, I'll I'll connect it to my phone. That way I'm using my phone's data first. You know, but at nighttime, you know, my phone is nowhere near my laptop, so I'll switch it back over to the Wi-Fi and then just let it do its thing as, a, as we're sleeping. Until uh, once we get on the property, though, we, we should be able to look into getting some better internet and uh, just seeing what we can do with that. You know, obviously, being a content creator or, or 
doing stuff, you know, with video is you, you need to have a little faster internet than, than 3G, you know, cell phone speed. <laughs> Otherwise, you're, you're going to be, you know, hurt. I mean, you can always pack it up and, you know, go to some coffee shop or whatnot and, and go steal their Wi-Fi or, like, a Walmart parking lot or something like that. I know people have done that. You know, and if, if I really needed to do something like that, I, I will. But I don't need to do that. Because our internet normally is good enough, especially with a booster. It's, it's normally good enough. It's only a hit or miss. You know, normally when a storm comes through, it's whenever we have those issues like that. You know, I gotta, I have to reset it. You know, reset the the booster, reset the the jetpack, and you know, do all the things <coughs> to get it to reset to the antenna. But some days it's just super, super slow, and that's what happens. And then, also, like I said previously, you know, the uh, we had our doctor's appointments. We were gone. We didn't even get home until afternoon. And so by the time, if I was to try to upload a video, it wasn't going to happen. It wasn't going to happen. So, so here I am on Saturday driving to the big city so I can go get some tools. Alright y'all, I'm going to leave this one short and sweet, just uh, oh, try to stay busy, we, we got a few days without rain, so I'm going to try to go get a, a new culvert for the driveway that's right there next to the gate, get that put in, and then also try to put that other uh, smaller culvert that washed out, put it further up the driveway, so I'll see if I can't get that knocked out. You know, during these uh, times of dryness, we'll see. Cause I, I still got a lot of things I need to move, but I can't move the stuff onto the property if I can't get it onto the property. I eat trailers and, and such like that. So. Uh, all right, y'all. So make sure you're thinking of veteran every chance you get. Not only on Veterans Day, and we'll see y'all next. One. Later, y'all.